Let's have a look at my pepper plants. Do you see peppers growing? Wow, beautiful, growing your own peppers. These are all pesticide free as well. That's why you can see holes in the leaves. Pests eating the leaves. Sometimes they do attack the plant, uh, the fruits as well. Uh, but as I said, I'm not bothered because I get plenty of peppers growing. So I don't mind the insects and animals having their fair share of these vegetables, which they deserve. As long as I get a few, I'm happy with that. What I don't want to do is start using pesticides, which then affects your health and is not very healthy for you. And that's what you're getting when you're going to the grocery shop, grocery store, or buying fruits and vegetables, which are not organic. That's what you get. Pesticide used on vegetables, unless they are organic, and even the organic ones, they're not 100% organic. So you've got to be careful. Look at that. Plenty of peppers. There's another one here. You see lots of flowers growing. These will all turn into peppers. Have a look, so we've got some peppers here, down here. It's not completely weed free as you can see. Um, I haven't been looking after them as well as I should. Even then, I've got peppers growing. Very, very easy to grow in buckets, in pots, whatever you've got. I picked these up from Poundland a pound each but you can grow them in um, old buckets like that Not this one recycled this uh, tile adhesive bucket and I'm growing a chili plant here so yeah you don't need to spend a lot of money to grow these fruits and vegetables in your garden and the reward is immense flavor and taste of these are just very different from what you would buy from the shops nice size as well most of the time they they, do, they don't grow as big but this one these are a nice decent size peppers I'm happy with these